Then try to give up. Uh, I, don't, I don't know. What's up you guys? I'm Chanel and I'm coming to you with soaking wet hair. Uh, I just washed it. I am about to try this here Tymo Volumizer. Now, if you've seen any of my past videos with me trying to straighten my hair, you know I'll, I've struggled with that. Um, and getting your hair straight as possible starts with the blow drying process. So I've tried the whole blow dryer brush method and it hasn't really worked for me. I need um, real professional help with that. Could someone call um, Deeper Than Hair for me, please? I need the girl to help me with my hair. Is she back in LA? Does anyone know? Anyway, yeah. So, so I decided to try this volumizer and see how short I can get with my hair. And if this works for me, type 4 hair. You see my hair? I ain't got that extra silky texture or anything like that. Um, <laughs> I've had hair dresses really struggle to get my hair straight. So, um, if it really works for me, then you guys know it will really work for you. And also, I got the straightening brush. The, the one that angles and I'll put the pictures up above. I got the two. So, you know, once I've tried this, I'll come back and do another video with like half my hair. One of those straighteners and half with the other. And then we'll go from there. But, um, yeah, let's get started. Let's see how this thing works. And we'll come back at the end. So the only two products I will be using for this blowout is the Chi 44 Iron Guard and the Chi Silk Infusion as the Silk Infusion only goes up to 300 to 350 degrees of protection and you know my hair needs more than that because I need higher temperatures of heat. How, and on top of that when it comes to blow drying I don't really know what temperature that heat goes up to so I want to make sure that I am covered with all bases. So what I did was just put this product product through that whole half of my hair and I'm thinking now maybe I should have waited and just started on the section I was working on. Maybe letting that dry in too much um, added to making it tougher for me to get the results I want, which you'll see going down the line. I made sure that my hair was thoroughly detangled with the Denman brush before I even put that Tymo volumizer to my head because I don't I didn't want to have to deal with any snags. Uh, the product already has balls on the end, so I just you know wanted to make sure that I was extra careful with that and that wouldn't be an issue. You know, trying to reduce the breakage as much as possible. Same as I brush and I detangle my hair. I held my hair taut while putting the brush through my hair from ends to roots, making sure it's like fully dried and stretched as possible, making sure I get them roots, honey. I wish I would have part parted it better than that. Or should I say secure the top part of my hair better so that I wouldn't be fighting to not have the bristles pull the top part of my hair into the bottom part. Now I struggled with the front of my hair more than I did with the back. Now the front and the back are two different textures so that might be it but also like I was saying earlier maybe if I would have waited to put the Chi products in when I did that section it would have been more successful. Next time I try this, I will also try to re-wet this section too and see if that helps too. Because when I'm looking at this, it's looking a little stiff and I ain't, I ain't feeling it. Okay, it's been about 45 minutes since I blow dried my hair and this is how <laughs> it looks. Boy, oh boy, I can't skip the puff, huh? So I'm gonna try and just do another blow dry overall and then try to give up. Uh, I don't, I don't. 
Okay. So, this thing, besides it being huge, I mean, I was able to blow dry my hair very quickly with it. Um, it gets the job done really smoothly. I was concerned about the balls on the end, but it's still really flexible. Um, I just made sure, like, my hair was very, um, I make sure? I made sure that my hair was very, um, uh, detangled. That's the word. Okay. Um, there's still a lot of movement in my hair. Obviously, I didn't use a lot of product. Um, I kept it down with the 44 Iron Guard from Chi and then some Chi Silk Infusion. Um, so my hair feels nice and good, but uh, I just, it just wants to puff up. So I don't know. Today was pretty hot. I'm wondering if it's because of that and if I should really wait till winter winter. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I will definitely be using this product for sure because it makes blow drying super easy. It's nice to hold. It's easy to get through the hair. I don't have to be doing this two hand business. I like it and it's cute. <laughs> but I will be, I don't know. I feel like I kind of want to stretch my hair more because of you know how it all tangles up you see my hair's blown out and it still wants to frizz up and tangle up on itself um i might do that on a lower setting i'm end up doing it on a lower setting just to um help keep my hair from you know tangling on itself so we'll see how that plays out um yeah this is like Type 4 situations, y'all. Um, I just wanted to show you how it works on my hair because I've seen a lot of videos with girls with the silkier hair textures and, you know, all of us don't have that kind of easy um, life. And I love my hair. I think it's beautiful. Uh, I just, you know, a good tool is a good tool. So, yeah. Um... I've done a lot of trimming off um, certain ends. Not today. And I won't be trimming yet. Uh, let's see. Oh, my hair. So this is where we are right now. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna twist it up. And that's it. Okay, so let's talk about this. This thing is huge. It takes up a lot of space. I mean, like, look at it next to my head. Oh. It's pretty big. Um, but it's cute. It's nice. It's easy to hold. Um, it's The heat is really good that comes out of it. But my hand, you know, like, your hand doesn't get overheated or anything. doesn't really burn it. You know, just make sure you don't touch uh, this area, of course. Um, but yeah, like it, I would wish I could get it closer to my scalp, but in any event, it does the job. You know what I'm saying? It's not, there's nothing really special about this apart from the fact that it's quicker, you know, it's quicker and, um, you don't have to have two items, but then, you know, you have those, um, brush dryer, the hell are those things called those hair dryer yeah hair dryer brushes right so you have the ones that are regular shaped but this is kind of cool because it has that the flat shape and the rounding so if you're a person who likes to round brush you can do that with this or if you just want a straight brush you can do that with this um but yeah like it didn't do anything more special for me than any other um hair brush product hair dryer brush product that is out on the market just that it's quicker and it's cute like it's cute right <laughs> but yeah after i blow dried my hair and had the heat issue i ended up going back in with some um 
I foam. So I went and, and just foamed and and braided my hair down. So I got this effect, this and some oil. And that's about it really. I'm not trying to do any extra um, gelling or anything on my hair because I'm trying to keep my edges. And you know, you can see each, uh, I'm really overdue for uh, a henering because mm -mm, it's not working for me right now. And they look so long because my hair is all stretched out. But yeah, besides that, I think it's cute. I, um, I like the product. I will keep using it, but I won't throw out my blow dryer. I'm going to keep everything. Um, this just takes up a little bit more space. But I will be coming back with this and seeing how it works with the two flat ironing products that I purchased and we're gonna see how it goes. All right.